Hey, what's up guys? My name is Kevin. Welcome back to The Holler. Hey, so football season's starting really soon. Um, might be even today. So we gotta start thinking about some football food. So first up is cheesy jalapeno corn dip. So sit right there and let's get this game started. Welcome back guys to another video. Today we're going to start some videos on getting ready for the football season. You, know, you have people over, parties, whatever. Um, the first one we're going to do is a cheesy jalapeno corn dip. It's going to be really easy. It's not going to take very long. Uh, the first thing we're going to add is I have 8 ounces of cream cheese. I got it softened. So let's go ahead and just mix it up. All right, next thing is one cup of mozzarella cheese, one diced jalapeno, about half a teaspoon of salt, and you're gonna need about a quarter cup of uh, basil, but at the beginning, we're only gonna use about half of it. I have eight strips of cooked bacon chopped up. Also, only about half of it right now. And finally, you're gonna need some corn. This is three cups of corn. And what I used is this bird's eye frozen baby golden white corn. You could use can, you could use fresh, I guess. Um, I just decided to go with frozen. All right, and then let's mix this all up. All right, now you want to take your favorite oven safe um, skillet. I'm just using a cast iron skillet today. And we're going to put that mixture straight in. Go ahead and spread it around evenly. Go ahead and take your favorite rub. I'm gonna use um, some Gorilla Grills, just their all-purpose rub. You're not looking for much, just to basically color the top of it here. Just for a little extra flavor. And that's all there is to putting this together. Like I said, it's very simple. Um, and I do have leftover basil, and leftover bacon that will go, after this cooks for a while, we'll basically, right before it's finished, we'll put that on top of it. All right, let's go ahead and get it out to the smoker. All right, guys, we're back out here at the Silverback. Today, we're gonna be cranking it pretty high. I got it all the way up to 400 degrees. This is gonna be a fairly short cook. Um, the dip only needs about 20 minutes. We check on it and we'll finish topping it off. So let's go ahead and get it on. Now, if you don't have a pellet smoker like this where you can control your temperature exactly, you can do this in the oven, or if you're good at getting your own uh, smoker up to you know certain temperatures and holding it, anywhere between 350 to 400 is gonna work. So I'll see you in about 20 minutes. All right, guys, we've been going for about 20 minutes. Let's go ahead and check it out, see what we got. Look at that. All right, so we need to finish it off now. So I'm gonna take the rest of that basil and the rest of the bacon and put it right on top.
going to shut it up for about five more minutes and then uh, we're going to call it good. All right, guys, we've been cooking right at 25 minutes now. Let me go ahead and get this off of here and we'll show you what it, I'm going to let it cool down for a little bit and then uh, we'll go ahead and give it a taste test and show you what it looks like. Let's go ahead and get it off. All right, guys, here's our finished product. See, it's still pretty warm. It's bubbling up pretty nice still. But man, look at it. Don't it look good? Let's go ahead and give it a taste. It's got all this corn and jalapenos and bacon in there. Let me try it. Man, oh man. This is definitely one to put in the books, guys. You got a football game coming up, anything? A gathering? I've actually got a gathering tonight, so that's what I actually made it for tonight. And I'll have people, you know, test it out when they get here. But this is excellent. Real easy to make. We did 400 degrees on the silverback. 25 minutes. Not a big deal. So that's it for our cheesy jalapeno corn dip. As always, if you got any questions or comments, go ahead and leave them below. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And always, holler back.